It's time for some more Crash 2, everyone. Hello, everyone. Crystal Vision here, and welcome back to you. More Crash 2. And, um, this is part, uh, what part? 30, I think it might be 32. Yeah, so we're, we're, we're heading towards the end of the game. Um, and we're in uh, Night Fight, which I think, personally, is a pretty tough level. Um, not impossible, but just not, um... Not easy by any means, you know, the, you know, the difficulty. I actually kind of enjoyed these levels. I mean, there's two dark levels in the whole game. The first one, which is actually technically considered as the last level, um, you know, you guys remember seeing uh, Totally Fly. Yeah, you know, that that's technically the last level um, in the game, the level 27. Um, but, yeah, we did that first, you know, as part of the whole... Um, uh, you know, death route, um, I mean, no, sorry, like, secret, you know, warp room and all that stuff, you know, might as well just do it when we can. Um, so yeah, this is the final, second and final, um, dark level that we get to do. And, um, you get the gem here, and I just want to show you something. The best way to do this is to just suicide down here, and then it takes you back, you go down the regular path, and then you, oh, you, oh, you'll see, you'll see. <laughs> that was an accent, by the way. Um, so yeah, I'll explain it again in case anyone didn't see Totally Fly, but yeah, so you get the fly, um, thing of the, the night light type guy, um, which by the way, uh, returns in, okay, wait, yeah. oh, pff, got stuck under there, okay, sorry, um, the night guy, whatever, like he, um, yeah, the night like thing follows you around, and when it and it only lasts for a certain amount of time. It isn't a ridiculously uh, short amount of time, but you do kind of have to be quick. You, you can't be too much of a slacker, basically. Um, this bit's kind of annoying. Okay, there we go. Excellent, excellent. You got these little homing things which can get in your way, and you've got to kind of navigate them. And, if you, I think you can jump over them, but it's a bit of a risk, really, I don't think. See, look, okay, look, we run out. There we go. Excellent. But, so, basically, when you run out, I, I suggest, unless you know that there's, like, a box in that area, just sort of go on the sides and jump across there so then you don't fall down any chasms or anything. Um, here's a bonus round. Excellent. This is the, uh, this is the second to last bonus round we will ever do. Now, I've missed this now this is another one this one just actually keeps going i think it keeps going regardless of whether you do or not or maybe that's the other bonus right? i can't remember but it does run out after a certain amount of time so you get that one get those two just kind of yeah once again um obviously you, you know you expect the difficulty to increase um so you do kind of have to be quick in a way um you know don't be too slow i think it runs out in a second yeah there we go just on time um, and wait, look at how many, do you see, we were over a hundred apples, uh, wampers or whatever. That's actually, that's probably one, I reckon that's, like, if you're just, like, not even trying to get them all, that's probably almost the highest amount of, um, apples you can get. Like, it's still going all the way here, so, wow in that regard. Wowzers, okay. Now, I went slow there, get those two, and then we got that. So now we've got to kind of speed it up just a bit, because we need to, get, oh no, whoops, <laughs> fail. Absolute fail. Okay. So we gotta go back now, that's okay. I'll use the the good old slide spin just to sort of uh, get us further quicker because, you know, it obviously it helps. Okay, there we go. So yeah, you know, if you slide spin this, you know, which is technically a glitch, um, you can get through much quicker without half the amount of stress. Um, uh oh, and, oh shit. There we go, okay. So now I'm going to take it patiently here, not fall down. There we go. Here we go. Let the fun begin. Whoa. Oh, watch that rat, bastard. Okay. There we go, checkpoint. Um, so yeah, the music, by the way, it stays the same um, as, you know, the first level. So it's kind of it's kind of a, a nice uh, thing um, that you've got, um, what's it called? The same music, kind of a bit of a, a, a reminisce back to the old days, even though it really was only like four warp rooms ago, but you know, it's a big sort of contrast from the first warp room, you know. Um, yeah, that's cool, you know. Okay, they're done. Let's get our relevant gems and crystals up into the warp room, whatever. Okay. And nearly done. Alright, in the next part, 
Angus Nintendo 64 will be joining me when we go to Pack Attack, uh, which is a, uh, I don't know, is it, is it a really hard level? I don't know. We'll have to see when we get there. Thanks for watching, guys.